Mary Astor was an American actress. She began a long motion picture career as a teenager in the silent movies of the early 1920s. Born on 3rd May 1906 in the United States, Mary Astor died on 25th September 1987 in the United States. Said, life without emotions is like an engine without fuel. Wow, emotions, fuel. <laughs> I was just thinking about the Zen which tells you, teaches you neither this or that and all the Indian spiritual masters are taught not to show the expressions on the face whether anybody comes and tells you somebody died, no expression, somebody is born, no expressions. And there was one lady called Gita from the Chinmaya Mission. So she used to go and tell Chinmaya Mission Swamiji. I don't know whether they saw me, Brahmananda Ji or who oh, it. She goes and says, Swamiji, will you go to Rakum school? Swamiji, can, can we invite you to Rakum school? Swamiji, did you have your food? Swamiji, did you sleep? Or did you have your... Anything she said, Swamiji said, <laughs> and she was going very mad. She came and told me. I said, yes, the moment we open our mouth to say anything, you twist and turn. I don't think. Now I'm thinking it's not the twist and turn. You are just scared. Better show the emotion. So what? The biggest success story of the Karnataka's tallest leader, Deve Godoji, was the ex-Prime Minister also. He's emotional. Yes. People loved it. All the villages loved it. When I came to Devanagali, I was shocked for the first time I found out you can write anything in the newspaper and the TV. People don't believe. They just decided Devi Goraji is the God because I asked them, how come he become God? And they told me, when somebody dies in a house, he comes and sits there. He cries along with us. He takes bath, have food, sleeps, then he moves. A child is born, is there. Any function, is there. He, that makes us to feel that a leader has got emotions and the emotions creates a thunder, a lightning effect, a powerful magnetic force which spreads the length and breadth to wipe out more tears and bring down hunger. That can be a great powerful <laughs> life without emotions is like an engine without fuel. It's like you are moving to the great cities and you find many many friends in the in the in the clubs in different different arenas but all those engines without fuel the real life is the fuel with engine yes is your family the joint family and the family tree and that is disconnected you keep on buying your engine is not running and you go to tell their problems and those people in the workshop will ask you to buy a new engine you buy the new engine it comes with a little oil on it or fuel on it it may run for some time but again it breaks down in your family it is permanent pan PAN card, permanent account number of your fuel. It is never ending because it is like a relay. One, one fuel finishes, another auntie catches, another uncle catches, another grandmother catches, grandfather. It is a link, a powerful fuel till your death or even after your death, you can see it is just burning. It is burning. It's not a fuel. It doesn't stop. It doesn't take rest. It is just burning non-stop. Yes. That was the power. They keep telling, you are running a car on petrol. And if you put diesel, will it run? It will not run. It is almost like that. You go to the city, you go to the club, you are trying to put uh, diesel in, but that, will, that vehicle is not running. And you feel sad, you feel loneliness. And then you, you keep telling, I am having many, many problems. Psychologists, psychiatrists, all comes running. Depression, they call it. No, no. <laughs> Mary Astor found a life without emotions, like an en engine without fuel. No emotions. <laughs> Certain people, I go to the houses, dead. 
as if I gone to do something and another man came next to me and said, Theod put you in a, in a higher pedestal and you are not showing sure expression. Sure, you express smile at me. I have to rush up to them and say, hi, namaste. Keep please give me your hand. Some people are dead and uh, we on there to keep telling many people are walking like dead bodies. <laughs> put some life, that life which got disconnected because you are not being able to show love or accept love. You have taken everything for granted and you look at others and you find everything is yellow feverish, yellow fever because you having a yellow fever. Come out of that. Life without emotions. Yes. Life without power. Yes. If there is no muscle in your body, when you fall down, you break your bone. 40 to 50, 50 to 60, 60 to 70. All non-stop without a break seven days you have to do your exercises the muscle one day you miss it the gap that is called communication gap greatest hurdle of any development you are you are hurt that minute this is a communication of your body with your power your body with your muscle building up the muscle power is very important yes that comes only from your physical labor yes keep your washing machine to the side only for emergency use it all of the days wash it with your hands janga 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 jing 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 janga 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 chik 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 squeeze it up you got all your exercise and you keep sweating and then for the first time you move into the sunlight to dry it you got the sunlight into your body which kills all your cancerous cells yes. for a time being you stop buying the what do you call masalas? You take the chili, you grind it, jing, 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 jing. You take the rice and you grind the rice, jing, jing, jing. <laughs> yes, you find the first time, yes, your emotions is like an engine with full of fuel. Otherwise, all is disconnected. The moment you use your washing machine, the moment you use your television, I'm not telling you, television, but television, the moment you use your car, the moment you use motorbike, yes, it is like an engine without fuel. It is without emotions. It is got disconnected from your love. You cannot love anybody, yes. You cannot go and keep on complaining to the church, temple, masjid. Yes, nowhere else. The moment you connect your people, your Sanskriti, the first time you see your church right inside your house, you see the temple right inside your house, you see the masjid right inside the house, you see the God right inside your house, you are 